Okay guys, today you will be patrolling the Mike Delta area of Southwark, that's in North... Oh, damn, who am I kidding? These are all AI. Well, welcome back guys to another day in LCPDFR 1.0, day 7 today. And today, well, it's coincidence that I'm going to show you something special. This is the Ford Tornado that I've been working on, it's my first conversion, and as you can see, try to get it as re accurate as possible without taking too long to do it and yes it is a work in progress but if you've been watching this from the future then maybe it isn't a work in progress it's already released so check my channel and yes I've worked on the strobe lights now they're on the front it really just has a black tape around them but I can't be to do that at the moment maybe later on and let's get a patrol started and look at this mandem what is he doing boy jog on mate right Let's get started. So this is an officer carrier and it's referred to in the Met as the special bus because the volunteer police officers, the specials, they tend to end up getting crammed in the back of it like these guys right now. And yeah, they're pretty pissed off because all the car keys to the uh, car park, everybody's took and all the nice shiny police cars and all the crap high eyes are left behind. And He's got, all these guys can do is just have to sit in my back of my van and chill for a bit, you know, they don't get their own car. So they're pretty pissed off, but yeah, I'm not because I'm driving. I have to play by my rules because it's my van. Right, so, to be day, we hit the streets and let's find some callouts. Just enable my wave hearts in a minute. Oh, what's going on there? Shit, someone just stole it on his car. Right, Mike Delta 01 in pursuit of a black cabbie stolen. Oh, he just collided with a pedestrian as well. well. Hold on a sec. Let me just adjust my brightness because this is a bit too bright for me. Yeah, that's better. See, the bloom on my van was a bit too much and it was a bit silly really, but yeah. That's, did this game with EMB, you've got to dynamically adjust the weather settings really to your own preference depending on the time of day and what you're looking at in the game. Oh, well, you stop there, sir. Get out of the fucking car. Get out of the car, please! Get out of the fucking car! Pull him out, pull him out, pull him out. Right, you're under arrest. Get out of the fucking car and stand on the floor there. Put your hands on your head. Put your hands on your head. Now. And you're under arrest. You don't have to say anything but may harm you to self defense. If you fail to mention anything, when questioned, something you should later go down in court. Anything you do see may be given in evidence. Over. Right, um. Mike Delta 01. We've got one IC3 male in. Detained at. What road are we? Switch Street, Fort Side. Take him to the station. Right, guys, get in. Yeah, I'm gonna leave one officer behind to clear up the scene. God, come on. How would this guy get. Oh, damn, of course. Damn it, of course. I'm supposed to grab hold of him and then he'll automatically get in the van. Now I know. Right, let's get my specials away from me first so they don't take his space. Oh, damn, watch your, watch your way, traffic. Ah, here we go. He's automatically got in there. Here we go. Alright. Get in. Yeah, you stay behind, mate. Damn, the traffic's going mad. Obviously, they can't handle the fact that someone's parked in the middle of the road, even if it's a police van. It's a shame, really, because real traffic isn't like this one bit. Well, only occasionally, anyway. Oh, look at that, my loyal partner following me. Even though he's no longer in my van, he's still, he's still running to me. Now, that is loyalty. See? But you haven't got, you know, it's not every day you've got colleagues that are that loyal. Maybe he just wants a ride. <laughs> he doesn't want to be left there hanging there on his own. Out of the, the way, man. Yeah, here we go. He's taking him to the Nick. And he's under arrest. Yeah, that's what she said. Now my guys will be able to get in the van, and we can go back on a call out. That's one arrest for today, I feel quite proud already. 
Oh, they're all in the van again. Why well, should call it the minibus, really? The special bus. Because these cops are sort of special now. Uh, let's go onto the main road of Bohan because it's way too crowded here with GTA 4 anyway. I mean, in real life I wouldn't mind this, but this game, shit happens. And it's not GTA 4 itself or any of the mods individually, it's just the fact that I'm all running them at once and, you know, it's not recommended. But, you know, I get a brilliant game out of that and I'm willing to take the risk. But I'll try and minimise the risk as much as possible, that's why I take measures like I do driving away from certain areas or something. You'll get to know if you play the game with scripts like this, you'll end up knowing its all quirks and what to do, what not to do, sort of thing. Alright, let's set ourselves available for cool. that's fine. See, Mike Delta 1, that's Southwark by the way. A very vibrant borough in South London. Mike Delta 1 is now on service. Over. Ooh, I'm not going to take him for that, he's transport for London. CCTV will get that bus driver. Out and stuff. Give me a call out. Let's go. I went to a red light and I'll refresh the call outs again so that we can get another one because it doesn't seem. Oh! No. Shots fired, cool. I'm not going to take firearms calls for obvious reasons. For the start, we haven't got yellow dots on this windows of this van, so we're not armed. Well, my colleagues are armed, but I can't be bothered to taser the weapons off them, because for some reason, with the new mods installed, they end up becoming hostile to me. So I'd rather just have them with guns, and they won't use them. They'll only use them if someone like throws something at me or shoots at me, or stabs me or anything like that, or anything nasty. But probably, probably, so that's interesting. But otherwise, you know, they're fairly well behaved. But with 1.0, it's changing the AI cops' behaviour, so they're much more well behaved now. So I've got to say, that's another brilliant feature that you wouldn't notice every day that they really worked hard at. And let's get some robbery in progress. We'll get there quite quickly. Change the siren and he notices me now. Take a break to the end spend. I'll probably turn my siren off when we get closer to the crime so we don't want to notify them as much. And it's still winter, that's why there's no leaves in the trees and the grass is dull as fuck. Let's stop here and give ourselves ample room. Alright guys, let's go, let's get him. That sounds exciting, let's get him. Her. It's got a pink shirt on. It must be a her. It could be a bisexual male. Alright. Mike Delta 1 on foot pursuing a IC3 female robbery in progress. Stop there, man. Alright, stop right there. Oh, she's not IC3. Drop the knife! Drop the knife now, or I'll tase you. Drop the knife now. Stop, drop the knife! Drop the knife, this is your last chance. This is our final warning. Right, taser. Taser, taser, taser. So there you go, see? Get on the floor, get on the floor, get on the floor. Put your hands on your head, this is your last chance. Put your hands on your head right now. Put your hands on your head, you're under arrest. Right, you're under arrest, you don't have to say anything, but it may harm a defense. If you fail to mention anything when questioned, then you should later rely on in court. Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Do you understand? Right, let's take hold of her. Take her to the van. And the victim's just pissed off. She's just pissed off, really, the victim. So we, we've we only got the mugger at the moment. And I can't be bothered to go to the victim because it's too long a walk. And would you really want to see me do that? I mean, a bit boring, isn't it? It's boring enough watching me take her to the van. But I think in patrols you should include these bits as well to make it even more realistic. I mean, you can't all have action all the time. I mean, you know, real police work isn't like that. There's some sort of degree of realism you want to include. And that's why I don't mind doing this. This is why I like taking it to the station, that sort of thing. I don't know, maybe different YouTubers have different ideas about things, but for me, I find it just fine the way it is. And as you can see, our officer, one of our officers is going to stay behind because there's no room for him in the van. Are you dumb, not get in the back. Yeah, he's going to stay behind and uh, follow me like a dog. Let's take a U-turn. 
and it's a nice bouncy van if you go through the suspension. The real vans are like that. You can go sick sitting in the back of one of them in the response. I heard a few of my friends in the specials said that, you know, you, you, some, one of them puked. It's like a boat, you know, it goes up and down. Look at the suspension thing, see? And then look at the way it tilts. I try to recreate that in game with my handling files and suspension of the vehicle. Right, so you can always red light. Green light now, yeah. As you see, look, it tilts like that. Oh, watch out. Yeah, it tilts when you're turning, just like the real one. It's the whole idea of the van is to be big and bouncy and like, you know, a minibus you can transport officers with. And keep your fingers crossed, we could have another, we could have a police chase, maybe. Stone vehicle, I'm hoping. Well, I'm hoping for anyway. So these vans do chase against stolen vehicles, so I saw one in the, in the alleyway once, chasing after a motorbike. A big van like this with like, say, four, five, six officers in the back. Oh, you won't want one of these chasing you, <laughs> believe me. It's, a, it's Maybe it's a slow vehicle, but if the officers get out, you're butt-fucked. They will fuck you up. Because there's loads of them. They'll all jump and run onto you like, uh, like, like you said a swear word in an, old, in an opera hall. <laughs> yeah, security. Like security guards, you know when the Jeremy Kyle shows when they chuck the chav out, they, they run after him and pull him back and say, get back here you fucker, come back to the show, not be a coward. There we go, speak of the devil, security guard there, G4S, taking her out the van. Son. So she's a transvestite, is she? Well, he can see better than me because he's right next to her as I'm sitting inside the van. Here's a nice slick little trick you can use to get your bodyguards back to you. Just teleport all bodyguards to the player and lovely jubbly gets back in the van. Let's go on another call out. And that was brilliant. That was the first two call outs we did. Well, the first one wasn't a call out, but it was a, uh, it was a uh, crime, wasn't it? And let's get back on the draw. <laughs> I heard in rough areas they use this van for general patrol as well. Like areas like Kentish Town, uh, see it, Beckenham, you know, uh, Bush and places like that. In the town, like town centres around tower blocks, they won't patrol in one or two, they'll patrol in like say four or five for their own safety because there's a lot of gangs over there with knives and guns that love jumping on top of cops and just shooting them. There's a lot of anti police sentiment in some areas and it's understandable sometimes, but you know. Super respect, they do keep an order in our society. But yeah, I'm keeping order in this fucking wacky city right now. Liberty. The worst crime rates for a London borough, the London borough of Liberty. Yeah. Nice people take drugs. You see, I saw that advert on a bus once, and I thought, alright. I was wondering what adverts to put on my London bus. Well, not my London bus, but my London bus skin. And I thought, alright, let's put a nice perky with people take drugs, because as I was making the skin, I saw one of them go past my house, and the huge banner was just looking at me. So I thought, yeah, okay. Let's do it. And by the way, I'm not going to take the once person, because that's just. You know, he's an armed suspect, and I don't want my officers getting fired upon. Right, reports of a fight, that's exactly what we're for. We are the incident response unit, or the operational support unit, if I remember. We are the uh, mini TSG, I suppose, the mini white police. We're not, you know, not white police, but like mini ones. <laughs> well, here we go, is the fight. Right, Mike Delta, spawning over. Left here. Let's go right here. Let's go right. I should leave my sirens up for longer. Unless the traffic moves out of the way, don't move out of the way. Oh, bloody hell, you'd expect better from another police officer, wouldn't you? Let's 
sit down here. I'll keep the reds on, as you can see. Tail reds. Just like the real van. Alright, let's go, guys. Keep an eye out. Oh, shit, it's a large fight. Oh, damn, we have to break it up. Alright, guys, break it up, break it up, break it up, break it up. Stop right there. Back up. Oh shit, he's going, he's going all American on these guys. Sorry, I didn't, it's not my choice to make him shoot at these uh, people, but I can't really be bothered to take the guns off them, so I'll just have to bear it. We need a bit of martial law in this area anyway. Stop it, stop it right now. Break up the fight or you'll be shot. Times are tough, even the Met Police are being armed now. Attacking us as well. Yeah, apologies for the gunshots. They're not supposed to use their weapons, but I couldn't be bothered to tase the weapons off them. So I'll just let them sort the situation out. They know best anyway. You know what? Let's leave those idiots fighting. I don't even give a shit. And I don't want to see anybody getting shot, so. Yeah. We'll just call more backup. Pretend that we called TSG unit over here, and then. Uh, We'll just sit on the patrol again. I think from now on, I'm going to let my partner have a gun anyway, because I don't want to tase them. Because when I do tase them, they don't get in the van with me, or they stay in the van. And then when I get out of the van, they end up taking the van from me. It's like I've made them hostile, which is a bit odd. This didn't happen like that in the last version, but I think it's 1.0's new AI system. But there's a lot of good sides as well. Like The AI system will actually, the AI on 1.0, they'll actually defend me. They won't just they won't fire unless somebody's attacking me directly. Ooh, reckless driver. But yeah, you know, it's got his ups and downs, and I think the ups way out the downs really. That's why I'm playing it. Oh, you have to be that mean, come on. I was you know, I, I wanna go against a reckless driver, I want a police chase. Police chase just finishes patrol off and be brilliant. Not a shot's fired, cool. Don't be silly now. Come on, give me something better. I deserve better, I made this van for fuck's sake. <laughs> well, I didn't make it, the model itself, but I highly edited it and converted it completely into GTA 4, so yeah, I'm now converting models. Ooh! Reckless driver. Thanks, uh, VDH police helper. Save my day. Alright, let's chase after him. Will you stop your vehicle? Is he going to stop? He's gonna stop. Alright, let's have a look at what's going on. Let's set some cones up here as well so that the idiot traffic don't bash into me. Alright, uh, zero, th one, keep an eye on this guy. It's a bit dodgy. Alright, mate, you were driving a bit recklessly back there, and I'll see your ID for a minute. Yeah. Aggressive driving. Let's have a look at your license. I'm gonna run up the computer. Done that for ages. Get back in the van. And hopefully ELS won't trigger off now. Thank God. Thank you again, 1.0 team. Fucking brilliant. Chaz. Yes, I'm very proud. I'm very, very pleased at this menu not conflicting with ELS now. Let's wait forever. Oh, here we go. Time spot. Wanted? No. Citations. One. License valid. Okay, I'm going to let him off with a driving ticket then for his reckless driving. Tell him that if he does it again, he's losing his taxi license and he can't. You have to drive the car back to the rank. Alright, mate, yeah, I'm going to give you a citation here. I don't want the UK word for it. God, I've never been pulled over and actually issued a ticket on the spot. But, yeah, I'm going to give you a citation. Don't do that again. I see you doing that again. You must pay the fine by uh, is it 12th of February or your fine will be increased to. 200 pounds. Okay, be on your way. That's right. And if you want to appeal against it, 
It takes two weeks to process your appeal. So by the time you've appealed, if we don't process it, then you're charged double the price. Woohoo! You've got to love London boroughs. You've got to love that London borough mentality with all their parking tickets. Do one more call out and then probably get back to base. But let's hope it's a stolen vehicle or something. That's something exciting like that. Ooh, damn, we got an error. All right, fuck you, police and scripts. We'll just have to do it the old way. I'll look up for some crimes when I get to the police base. And if not, then I'll just... Well, I'll just you know, call it a day. But, okay, I'm going to drive back to the police base now. If we see any crimes, like, on the street, using the police and police helper, then I'll respond to them. So keep an eye out, guys. And yeah, you can't tell me what's happening, because I've already done, I've already played. But if this is not if this was a live stream, you could help me, and I can read the comments on the second monitor my second monitor. I've got one, but yeah, I mean, that might be a good idea, actually. The red car there is driving recklessly. Let's check him out. Is he an IC3? Oh, she's an IC3. Best to leave it, she's a female driver. Can't help it. <laughs> Sorry. These jokes get a bit old now. Over here. Alright, we've gone back to the station. Unfortunately, we didn't see any crimes, but yeah, there's always next time. Well, hope you enjoyed this patrol. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, like, share your audience and I'll see you next time and check the transit van check my channel out because it's going to be released there on my YouTube channel the channel you're watching this video from so yeah you don't forget to subscribe for the best Met Police mods out there the exclusive one and only Met Police mods and I'll see you till next time